Last season was one of transitions for the Elon women's basketball team. Now in the second year of the Charlotte Smith era, the team is looking to make great strides despite the loss of several key players to graduation. And with eight underclassmen on the team, there's a delicate balance between youth and experience. It's an interesting mix because we have a lot of experience, you know, in terms of, you know, our senior class, and then we have a lot of youth, and we're trying to find a way to mesh all of that and make sure that, you know, our underclassmen are up to speed. And I think our seniors have done a good job of leading them and trying to, you know, help our freshmen get on board. You know, you always want to have the experience, and I think that um, not only is this team balanced, but you have your upperclassmen who are being dependent on and expected to contribute the most, and then you have, you know, um, your sophomores and juniors who have, you know, seen the conference, have, you know, been around the, um, the SOCON and know what to expect, and then you have your freshmen who have all these people that they can look up to and learn from. The team's journey begins with several tough non-conference games, which they hope will prepare them for their road to the Southern Conference Championship. It'll challenge us, and I think it'll prepare us for the Southern Conference, and that's what the senior class wanted. They wanted to be challenged this year, and I think we'll learn a lot in those games early that will prepare us for conference play. I'm thrilled about our non-conference schedule. Um, I think being able to play these tougher teams is really going to help us um, in the SOCON, because the SOCON, it's going to be a really tough conference this year. It's going to be a, a really, really good, really strong. The better teams you play, the better you get, and that's you know common knowledge. And if you want to be the big teams, you got to play the big teams, and you got to put yourself in a place to beat the big teams. And to be the best, the team will rely on its greatest strength, leadership. Allie Ford and Kelsey Evans has done a tremendous job of, you know, being great leaders in the off season and just guiding the young ones in terms of preparation for what it takes to be ready for the season and I think they did an outstanding job in the off season and then on the court you know they're doing a tremendous job of you know leading the freshmen and teaching them you know what our expectations are. The way that we you know battle each other in practice and how the the older ones push the younger ones and how the younger ones kind of look to the older ones to you know see what they're doing and um, just kind of staying with the flow. Um, you can't teach that and I think that that's probably one of our strongest points is that you know at no point in time this year should we go without leadership or should we you know be down on ourselves because no one else is talking or no one else is uh, like setting the bar high. We have a good senior class and we're trying to you know be great leaders for the younger ones and but I think the best thing that we can do is lead by example and be vocal. And with a new season comes new expectations. This year's goal win the Southern Conference. We expect to win the Southern Conference Championship. That's our goal and that's what we talk about and that's what we believe in. And we know that it's going to take de dedication and determination day in and day out and it starts in practice and I think we've done a great job thus far and we're just excited and looking forward to the season.